Welcome, old friends and new, to the Bring Your Own Grief Network and a special episode, Daily Inspirations. January 16th, and today's Daily Inspiration comes from Khalil Gibran, a Lebanese-American artist, poet, and writer of the New York Pen League, who lived from 1883 to 1931. Gibran was wise enough and compassionate enough to give us the following inspirations in our grief journeys. The lights of stars that were extinguished ages ago still reaches us. So it is with great men who died centuries ago, but still reach us with the radiations of their personalities. Now, Gibran tells us truth that the shimmering lights of a dead star remain visible to us long after it may have extinguished. While he may speak of great men who died centuries ago, so too, for me, does it relate to our lost loved ones, the ones we watch shine during our lifetime. That light, that influence, shines on and continues to fill our hearts and spirit with their beauty and love today. When I think of the influence my dear son holds on me, I find comfort in what we read in Gibran's words. My late son Jonathan shall light my way, and eventually it will lead me to where he is now. I so look forward to your thoughts on this. Let me know, please. So that's today's daily inspiration and my thoughts. But you know, as well as I do, we are all as unique as snowflakes and fingerprints, aren't we? You may well take the words differently and I ask, I welcome and would love to have you leave your unique understanding of the words we shared together in the comments section below this YouTube video. Please do. I welcome the conversation, the chance to start a dialogue and get to know the thoughts of my fellow grievers and maybe maybe travel a little farther myself down the path of hope and healing. If you found value in this daily inspiration, please like it here on YouTube and share it with others. Share it with those you feel could use a hand to hold on to. And please subscribe to the BYOG Network YouTube channel. The more likes, shares, and subscribers we have, the easier it is for other bereaved souls to find help in their search. So thank you for spending this time of healing with me. No, I am so very sorry for your loss, as I know you are mine. I am R. Glenn Kelly. May you find peace and purpose.